The greatest investment a community can make is assuring the best learning environment for all of its young children. Each day, more than 60 children from the El Paso Head Start program board a big purple bus that takes them to a world of innovation, adventure, and exploration at the Region 19 Head Start Intelliseum in El Paso, Texas. The 2,754 square foot Intelliseum is an interactive, hands-on learning museum designed specifically for children in the three to five year old age group. It is the only museum of its kind in the United States and it serves the needs of more than 3,800 children in Head Start programs throughout El Paso and Hudspeth counties. The Intelliseum was the brainchild of Region 19 Head Start Executive Director, Dr. Blanca Enriquez. In January 2003, her vision of a state-of-the-art learning environment for children from a low-income background became a reality. My mission in creating the Intelliseum was to provide a very unique, innovative, and exciting learning environment for children that would focus on their linguistic and their cognitive development. Our children, our young children here in Head Start, come from very impoverished home backgrounds where they're only impacted by their, their home and, and their neighborhood. If they are to learn reading, writing, language, math, then we needed an environment that would provide them the experience, the hands-on experience that would expand their world, that they would live the experience and thus learn not only their uh, skills that we're talking about, but also in, a, in an environment that is truly their own. In the Intelliseum, children become doctors, become nurses, become architects and engineers. And when they walk away from this experience, they are saying, I am going to become a doctor. I am going to become an architect. And so not only have we provided the experience, but we have planted a seed for their future development. The Intelliseum is a very unique concept that not only enhances and expands the children's learning, but will assure that they, that they learn beyond the walls of the classroom, beyond the books, so that when they get to uh, public schools, their learning will be enriched. The investment is um, one in early childhood development. Research says that if you invest early in the learning of children, it's going to have great payoffs in the future. My vision for the future is that we will be able to provide this experience to many more generations of young children, as well as their parents. At the Intelliseum, children use all of their senses to explore new things and learn about worlds beyond their own experience. The interactive environments allow the children to touch and feel and see everything, from the rainforests of the Amazon to the cold conditions of the Arctic. Everything the children experience is sized to fit them, and all of the environments they experience allow them to get up close and personal with the exhibits themselves. But the Intelliseum offers more than just geographical exploration. It also gives them the opportunity to explore the Earth. Children see how the Earth existed years ago and have the opportunity to learn about geology, paleontology, and natural history. Children in the El Paso Head Start programs visit the Intelliseum three times throughout the school year. Over the space of that year, students will visit a total of 12 hands-on exhibits that emphasize skill sets in multiple areas. They also have the opportunity to explore everything from the Earth's past to the stars, planets, and constellations beyond the Earth. The exhibits are bilingual, with signage and learning materials in both English and Spanish. The curriculum at the Intelliseum is interdisciplinary in nature, covering all of the areas that children will be exposed to when they reach elementary school age. Instructors use technology and traditional teaching methods to enhance the children's skills in multiple areas. Children are exposed to the life sciences, and they get the chance to use child-sized versions of the tools that they may have seen in their daily lives, learning how those tools work and why they are necessary. Language and reading are key in all 12 of the interactive learning environments, and children have the opportunity to explore careers that require expertise with language, reading, and writing. In addition, they see how mathematics and science can be used in everyday life, from the drawing board, to the construction site, to the finished product. They also learn good stewardship, with explanations for how to use our natural resources responsibly 
and with respect for the environment. In the course of their explorations, students are introduced to upcoming exhibits and briefed on exhibits they've just seen in the Magic Eye Theater. This state-of-the-art panoramic movie theater was specially designed for the eye level of preschool children. The theater helps enhance oral language expression in children and extends their vocabulary while refining their listening and cognitive skills. When designing the Intellizium, the creators developed animated characters that guide the children through the individual exhibits. The characters were designed to be positive role models that are intelligent and knowledgeable. The fully bilingual characters give the children a level of comfort and familiarity that make the experience friendly and fun at all times. Water and electricity are already elementary parts of a child's life when they reach preschool age, and the water and exploring electricity exhibits help the children better understand how these resources work and how they can use them better. Children use fine motor skills to steer ditch gates that control and predict the flow and movement of water. Jasmine guides the children to a basic understanding of energy and electricity. The lead teacher supervises the children in using the Van de Graaff generator that lets the children experience the hair-raising feeling of an electrical current transfer. As the children enter the architects and engineering exhibit, they're encouraged to practice good safety procedures. They're given a hard hat, safety glasses, and a vest to wear as they explore the world of engineering. The lead teacher takes the children to the drafting table where they create and design a blueprint of a structure. This activity enhances their spatial concepts and fine motor skills. When children visit the Intellizium Times, they learn all about the mass communication industry, including the print and broadcast media. Madi, a news reporter, introduces children to the different vehicles used by the mass media. In the exhibit, children are exposed to age-appropriate websites and print media. The Medical Institute is a truly unique experience for children, as it is a rare opportunity for them to learn about the medical sciences in a safe, friendly environment. Brenda and Mikey greet the children and invite them to become physicians and or nurses. The lead teacher stresses the importance of good health, and the children see diagrams of the human body and learn interactively about the skeletal, muscular, and circulatory systems. Children even learn what it's like to be a certified physician when they sign their own certificates of learning. Technology probably already plays an important role in the world of these children, and it will definitely be an important part of their educational experience as they grow older. Technically savvy Sarah Ann leads the children through the interactive environment where the children enhance their fine motor and cognitive skills using age-appropriate software and hands-on activities. The world has no boundaries for children who visit the Intellizium space exhibit. Visitors don their space shuttle uniforms and board the shuttle for a journey that is literally out of this world. Fernie is the children's guide into space, where they use touchscreen computers to use and enhance fine motor and cognitive skills as they engage in hands-on space activities. Children explore the fascinating wonders of the universe. They see the moon close up, check out the constellations at the Constellation Station, learn the names of the planets at the planet wall, and see the world from a different perspective at the Intelliscope Observatory. Children experience a prehistoric journey back in time, beginning with the dinosaur time zone machine. Dino Danny guides the children through the dinosaur exhibit, showing them how the world looked millions of years ago. Wearing their paleontologist hats, children are led by Dino Danny to a hands-on activity that reinforces and enhances their knowledge of natural history. Children develop numerous skills as they use a chisel to discover fossils, match dinosaur bones to a corresponding skeleton, and distinguish characteristics of the different dinosaurs. Children enhance their vocabulary and learn about the inner earth as they identify the various skills used in a dig and explore the workings of a volcano. Children also learn about the places they can visit on the surface of the earth with three distinct environments that teach children about how things grow and live in different parts of the world. The children's guide around the world is Rico who starts with an air adventure. Children will board an airplane where, after fastening their seat belts, the children view videos that teach them about the Arctic, the tropical rainforest, and the ocean, which they explore after they deplane. As children enter the frigid area of the Arctic, Benny offers the children fleece pullovers and mittens. Children view a mural depicting Arctic life and feel the temperature drop a few degrees as they walk on the foam-sculptured ice flooring. As they enter the rainforest environment, children learn about the plants, animals, and people who live in this misty, humid climate. The sounds of tropical birds and the moist air add to the experience of being in a rainforest. 
and children point out the various flora and fauna that make this environment unique. In the unique ocean exhibit, Benny takes the children to the depths of the sea. As they listen to the sounds of the ocean waves, the lead teacher introduces the children to a variety of saltwater fish and sea creatures in aquariums. In the hands-on touch tank, children see and feel the sea creatures that are depicted on the ocean mural that covers the walls. The Intellizium lead teachers work diligently to ensure that every Intellizium experience is insightful and productive. They meet regularly to discuss curriculum and individual lessons. They track the children as they come to the museum to ensure that each experience that the children have is new and relevant to the things they're learning at their Head Start centers. Before the children visit the museum, they prepare for the experience in the classroom. Each visit has a specific set of objectives and the teachers sit with the children and discuss what they will be seeing and hearing and prepare for the knowledge they'll gain on their visit. Classroom teachers are prepared to follow the learning cycle of awareness, exploration, inquiry, and utilization as the students explore the museum and expand on their current knowledge. Follow-up is very important and the Intellizium staff works with the individual classroom teachers to ensure that the knowledge the students gain in the Intellizium is carried into the children's daily lives and lessons. The Intellizium is an enriching, exciting experience for the children who visit each day, but it is an experience that enhances their lives long after they've left. The children who visit here take with them a vision of the future that includes learning and growing and exploring other worlds. It is the hope and vision of the Intellizium creators that with the seed that is planted here, these children will begin to see their future as a bright, hopeful, and productive place for them to be.